Hey guys, welcome back to another video on my channel. Today we're going to check out a really nice condenser USB microphone sent over by IVA. So I've actually been using it for the past few days and they sent this to me exclusive before the actual launch. So this is currently launched for 200 ringgit and it's called the IVA Phantom CM2U USB condenser microphone. So overall, I think that everything in this package is really good for the price and honestly, I've been using it for the past one to two weeks and it sounds really awesome. So a huge thank you to IVA Phantom for actually sending this over. Link of course will be down in the description below let's get this video started so this right here is the box of the IVA Phantom CM2U really excited to actually unbox this and get my hands on this they sent me a few pictures before this and I think that it looks really nice so let's just unbox it now so the box they sent me here is not the retail packaging I think it's just all white and then let's open it up and see what is inside the package So this is everything you get in the package, there's quite a lot of stuff and I would say that it's really nicely packaged. So let me just go through one by one what you get in the box. So the first thing right here of course is the instruction manual of the CM2U USB condenser microphone. So let's check out what is inside. So first thing over here it shows you the accessories, so of course you get a microphone, a tripod stand, the microphone clip and then a USB cable for the audio and here are the instructions on how to install it onto the stand and then connect the USB audio then you have a rundown over here of how the instructions work for the microphone so you have a microphone volume knob on top headphone volume control on the bottom and on the back of the mic of course there is a headphone monitor jack so you can plug in your headphones and on the top it's your touch key to actually mute the microphone then over here we have some specifications and on the back we just have some technical specs and how to use it on Windows and Mac and that is all for the instructions Let's check out other stuff so this is the cable that they actually gave so it does plug into the uh, microphone on this side and then we have an adapter right here so if you have type a on your computer you can just plug this straight in but if your computer supports type c or your phone supports type c audio you can just plug in with this adapter and it'll work really fine really long cable right here and i think that it'll work really fine for this microphone next thing we have here of course is the stand and this little hook so you basically can mount your microphone on here and then you can screw it onto the tripod base this is really good you hold your mic here and it will reduce the sound or any wobble or wind noise and then it connects over here of course straight to your tripod or your boom arm that you are using really good quality it is made out of plastic but it feels really solid and doesn't feel like it's gonna fall apart anytime soon and this of course is the tripod so it's a really simple tripod with this adjustable hole right here so you can angle the microphone to the angle you like it's also fully made of plastic but honestly it feels pretty solid and the non-slip feet here are pretty nice so once you stand it on the table it won't move anyway so there's all the accessories included now let's check out the mic itself so this is the microphone right here on the front we can actually see the logo and the name IVA CM2U right underneath that of course we have the volume control knob so this is basically how much your microphone is going to pick up can turn it all the way down or all the way up and then this right here is the output for the headphones so it's basically the headphones volume and as we said before the headphone can be plugged into the back so you can listen through the audio through this microphone pretty nice as well on the top part here we have the white section which is the receiver part or basically the microphone part really nice condenser part and it is actually white because there is rgb on this the rgb looks really nice i'm going to show you guys in a second and on the top here we have the mute button so when you press it once it's basically touch capacitive you mute the microphone you press one more time and it will unmute the microphone so this is basically what the mic is and on the bottom we have the usb pass through that will re basically record all your audio and let all the audio in and out of the microphone so it is partly metal and partly plastic built honestly it feels really solid right now and first impression so far it has a good weight to it and it has a really like premium feel to it let me just plug it in and show you guys the rgb i think it looks really cool so i just want to quickly explain how to install the microphone onto the stands given so this is the tripod stand right here all you have to do is find this screw in part and then find the part here where it screws into you hold it down and you basically just screw it all the way in until you can't screw it anymore and then this bottom piece right here you can just tighten it up by screwing it onto the top like this 
and then basically when it's all tightened up and really good you can angle the microphone and it should stand properly like this and nothing will actually move it really nice now i'm going to show you guys the other part which you can screw it into the uh, boom arm actually so it's really nice as well so this is the other piece right here that screws into the boom arm and it's basically the same thing so you find the place where you have to screw it in then you just screw in the microphone to the stand right here once it's all tight and everything you can just screw in this side right here to the connector on your boom arm and everything should work fine and it just looks awesome like this okay so i just plugged in the microphone to my computer and it's looking pretty good right now so once you plug it in it basically will turn on and this is what the rgb looks like so the inner white mesh that we mentioned just now actually diffuses the rgb really nicely so it does have a really like a uh, really good glow and it's like not too bright on one side or another it's basically really balanced and honestly it's just cycling through a few color modes right now i believe there is no software currently as it's just releasing but i think maybe in the future they could maybe add in like the rgb configurator or something like that if it is possible so first impression so far it feels really really solid and it looks really nice and on the top here if you tap the mute button when it's mute it basically will turn rgb off so it's an indicator that's really nice and if you want to talk again you press on it and the rgb will turn back on so honestly i really like this microphone right now what do you guys think for a microphone for around 200 ringgit which is basically usb and plug straight in to use so I think now we can go for the sound test and see how this mic sounds like. Let's go. So I currently have the microphone plugged into my computer. I'm recording the audio straight from this. So this is not edited at all. This is the raw audio. So I have the microphone around one to two inches away from my face. And I would say that the RGB is not like annoying at all. And I think that this microphone sounds pretty good for the price. And this is a real world sound test. So I do have like some outdoor noises and the fan running so this is how it will sound like if you're recording in a normal setting let's say in your room or you're just using it to game so just for some sound comparison i'm going to switch to the microphone on my camera right now so this is the rode video micro this is what it normally sounds like on the camera this is around i would say 10 inches away from my face and now we will switch back to the microphone so this is how it sounds like just going to test out the mute feature once you press the top button it actually mute and you can see that the rgb actually goes off and you press it again to reactivate the mic so honestly after using it for a few days it does sound really good to me and honestly it's one of the best condenser microphones now in the market for around 200 ringgit nothing really compares to it honestly with this feature as well i think iva really did a good job when making this microphone so that was it for this video guys so i've been actually using this microphone for the past few days and would say that i really really love it i love how it looks i love how it sounds and for the price i think it's pretty good and honestly this feature of the rgb really still mesmerized me i always look at it every day i think it looks amazing so again a huge thank you to iva for selling this over links will be down in the description again this mic will be launching at around 200 ringgit do check it out they're a pretty good brand especially a local brand in malaysia and for this being like one of their first microphones it's really really good so yeah that was it for this video guys leave a like on this video if you liked it dislike this video if you didn't like it subscribe to my channel if you haven't i have more tech stuff like this coming very soon and as always thank you for watching goodbye guys